Um, welcome back to Epicus Gamecus Musicus, here for the next episode of Red Music Thing. Uh, this is episode seven. Um, oh God! Not going to be a very long episode. No, it's certainly not as long as the last one. That was huge. Um, only got a couple songs here from Lamb of God, but they're all good ones. Right, where were we? Let's do a little bit of a recap here. What do we got to do? We got to do defend residents of Cola Springs. Claim a Bollard Twins Gang Bounty Alive. Okay. Complete Gap Tooth Breach. Where is Gap Tooth Breach? Ah. Yeah. Is that the mine? Or is that a. Is that the mine? We'll figure it out. Still don't have. I guess we have to wait for that um, bounty. It doesn't seem to have showed up anywhere. Uh, well, I guess I will. Yeah, I'll just travel to Armadillo and then ride to Benedict Point. I really can't be bothered to deal with that shit anymore. Every t every five minutes in this town. What's the point after a certain amount? I still have a land deed? What's the land deed for? Oh, the... Ah, oh, right. Okay, that's what I want in the... Layers thing. There ain't nowhere to camp. Well, Not in front there. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, so uh Lamb of God. Either a thrash metal or a groove metal band, it's kind of debatable, really. Um, I, I, I'm, I lean towards the groove. I, they're a little slower. They're not quite the, the frame piece of thrash metal. I guess they're... The key band from the new wave of America... The Iron Maiden of the U.S., I guess. <laughs> By a very vague comparison. Um, yeah. So hopefully some interesting stuff will happen on route. Uh, we'll give you over to Lame of God now. Uh, the first song is Laid to Rest. My personal favorite. Enjoy.
fastest in all New Austin right here. Yeah. You called Spatchcock? Well, who's that? a bit of a whoopsie. I don't... I'm not sure I knew I figured out the key to succeeding, succeeding in the uh, duels. It's like... Pull the trigger like a bunch of times and something happens. But I don't understand what that is. This fell out. Come on I don't think these guys are very smart. Trying to escape on foot in the desert. Definitely doing this the slow way around. And there's one. Didn't want to waste a bullet on this one. Let's go. Yeah, I can't be bothered to do the best one. Where do you think you're going? Do that one the easy way. I'll um, put you on the next song in a second so you can have some soundtrack for the. Uh, yes, yeah, so the next song is Walk With Me In Hell. Uh, enjoy. and gab tooth breach got my friend Floyd. Please, mister, you gotta help him. I'm in a bad way. I gotta get to a doctor. We was in the rail house when they jumped us. Maybe he's still around there. Get me out of this mess. I'll make it worth your while. 
debt to you, partner. But don't you worry, because I've got a way to repay that debt. Sons of bitches are hiding treasure in those caves. My friend and I was about to swipe it when they got me. Don't know where he got to. Anyways, if you get us to the mouth of the cave, I can show you where it is on your map. the treasure's at. You get me there and you get your share. You have my word. Hey, come on! Keep up! Keep up! This is a spot, all right, but damn it! One measly chest? Well, it's all yours, partner, for your troubles. I'm a man of my word. Where are your gumption at, gentlemen? That went well. Cool, I can get away with anything so long as someone on the hill. Need that. Oh lord, this is nasty. See if there's any more armadillos hiding. Yeah. Okay. 
right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna use some bait. A nice exposed area. Right here. See, bait is very good at getting coyotes. It's not so great at finding anything else. Oh, oh wait. Oh, more coyotes. <laughs> it's, oh, we've got two packs of coyotes now. Yeah? Well, that idea was busted. Can I have another that? Duel? We gotta come back later for the duel. California task, okay. I see the the snakes thing seems kind of random. Kill the what's a jackalope? Oh, oh, please tell me that wasn't the. Uh, I think it might have been actually. <laughs> Oops. Now we need to figure out what's this. No, nope, we're doing start in California. Awesome. Come on. Slow up. That's alright, thought I saw something. That's the trouble with this game is the motion of the game makes it kinda hard to see movement. Wait till it resets or something. And these are just sort of standing, not finished ones yet. Okay. Don't you worry about me. I'll get there my own sweet time. Well, there's a railway bridge there. We do need to go to Pun Punto or Gulu. That's the plan. Here we go. Let's start the last song, which is Redneck. Please enjoy.
do you want, gringo? What are you doing here? Are you going to ride with me? the Mexican army, I can see. I didn't know what to expect. I hadn't even crossed the border and I was being shot at. You will hear a lot of words like tyrant and oppression here. Words of the peasants have been taught, but do not understand meaningless words. The army is suffering uh, a crisis of reputation. Even I've heard about the colonel down here. He's not famous for his compassion. This is the point. I didn't last very long, did it? Do you know him? No. No, we're stuck in a machine. I can't he just repeat lies you heard. Baby. Allende is a good man, a strong man. He carries the weight of a million problems on his shoulders. Am I supposed to pity him? You gringos are so quick to judge. You love to talk badly about other people because it makes you feel better about yourselves. Maybe you should look in the mirror. You're the one talking about this. And I ain't here to make judgment on the way of your government. I've got enough problems with my own right now. This isn't America, Senor Marston. We are poor. Kindness must take a different form. What is better? To pull your arm around a hungry man, or to be him until he grows some food to eat? I think you need to answer that question yourself. Who are these I'm trying to figure out if that horse qualifies as white or not. The cowboy and his Mexican friend. Bill He's Williamson's a fella I used to know, and Javier Escuela? Well, I knew him too. What do you mean? You know this man? We was friends once. Part of a past I can't seem to get rid of. It is a snake. Hang on, I'm gonna get it. But I see a snake, and I want the snake. This is dirty. Does he keep riding, or does he stop? Oh, he stops. And I tell you to stay with me. You want my help? You obey my orders. Rebellion. It is a disease. Nothing it is, is more important than challenges. The right to stand up for themselves? Oh, wait, that was for the now. Right? The right? Don't you throw silly ideas at me. What do you know about the rights of the Mexican people? Very little. I'm just saying there must be something behind this rebellion. I'll tell you what's behind the Senor Marston. Lies. Insidious lies. I such an asshole is hogging up the middle of the road. Gals, they can be heard. It only takes a few men. To move many. Maybe they've just had enough of being called stupid. You're talking about things you don't understand. If you ask me something, I'm gonna give you an answer. Are you a revolutionary? Is that why you're here? I was once, I suppose. In a twisted kind of way. Thought I could change something if I fought hard enough. Change what? I don't know. Maybe that was the problem. Revolution is always selfish. There is nothing but greed and ego. Individuals putting their own needs above those of others. There is people fighting for change when they have no idea what change is. If you're a poor man who's been beat down all his life, any change is going to seem good. What? You think that overthrowing the government is going to make a poor man rich? If you're not helping them, it's only natural they're going to look for someone else who will. For a tired old revolutionary, you are very naive. What do you want us to do? Walk around giving out money? Every poor person in Mexico? <laughs> what a terrible idea. First, they need to look at why they're poor. Then they need to go out and do some work rather than sitting on their culos talking about freedom. Who's this man we're looking for? The leader of the rebels? Abraham Reyes? He's a traitor, a liar, a coward, and a sinner. A hero who has done nothing. I have far more respect for the shit I looked this morning. And I ever will for that pathetic war. That's a nice image. He is from a rich family. A man born in a golden cradle. Who pretends to fight for the poor. He's taking advantage of the ignorant and the weak-minded. He must be telling the people something they want to hear. Of course he is. All that bastard does is stand in a balcon, giving speeches. It is easy to make promises you can never keep. 
takes more than a few promises to build an army. Reyes wants power, nothing else. He doesn't care about anybody but himself. He's prepared to destroy everything my compatriots have fought and died for, just to hear people shout his name. Were you ever in the army? <laughs> no, sir. I was never in the army. No, oh, good. Thought as much. You have the air of a man who knows little of loyalty, and this one. And you have the air of a man who's too hasty to jump to conclusions. Do you have a problem with authority, Senor Master? If you were in the position I am, you'd have a problem with it too. Do you even believe in God? I don't believe in much right now. I'm just here to capture two men, like I told you. Well, believe this. I am the army, and I am the governor. If you want to hunt Alos, I will lay you. Kill them all. Oh, means. You will be doing me a favor. Can you? Devil's Canyon? I thought Colonel Olinda was in charge. Ain't you just a captain? It's not for now. Are you ready? Ready for what? We will lure the rebels into a trap. There's a train leaving to Barossa soon. We're going to escort. They will think it's a surprise train. There are no supplies on it. Where are you going? Get back here! Have you seen a prickly pear yet? I'm not completely certain what they look like. Come on! The train is waiting! Uh, uh, what? Come on! Come on! This way! Hurry! Well, we can on a train. We'll be on a train. Trains are helpful. I need to do that. There is a train! We must escort it to Casa Madrugada. Oh! I want to be on the train. This this might be the mission where you escort the train and you get on the train for the second half of the mission. Maybe. That was definitely not a waste. Okay, so if I just start out in front of the train and everything's okay. Dead 
That white horse go. Anything useful? Anything useful? Oh, we're not done. So much for bending the train. Trains were supposed to be fast. Uh oh. That's not good. Basically, rode from one end of the map to the other. Just come down here. All right, how are we doing? No reason to be in New Austin anymore. I see fucking far we are. Where we needed to be. What's that? Ah, oh, we'll deal with that later. Um. What's El Matadero? There's. Casa Madrid. Ooh, that's a new one. Las Hermanas. Is that Mesa de la Luna? Hmm. Well, let's see where we can go. <coughs> can you stay at El Matadero? The only thing I know about El Matadero is the best place to find snakes. Interesting here. Yep. Come on. Hey. 
Like, it's so easy to find snakes here, you'll sometimes just walk outside and there's one sitting right here. And it's raining. Okay. Guess we gotta get <sighs> Spend all my money buying apartments everywhere. Something ridiculous. Right, uh, next week, or next time, the, the best band from Texas? It's debatable. Um, ZZ Top.